we will be doing the vertical bull session now and it's not Jake White, uh, obviously, as you can see. Um, we'll start with the guys who are here and then we'll come back to you guys online. Please hang tight. Well, um, guys must be happy with that. I mean, there's, there's, there's not much you can, that the guys did wrong on it. No, I think, uh, I mean, she's happy with the effort the boys put out. Um, I was happy with the win, you know, that's that's what we set out to do and, uh, you know, it was a couple, couple of good things that happened uh, this afternoon. So, yeah, I think the boys are happy with uh, with, uh, with our game today. After after what happened a couple of weeks, in the last couple of weeks, a couple of months, should I say, is there almost a sense of relief that it feels like things are back on track? Yeah, I think so. I, I, again, um, I think we, even the when the results didn't come our way, and at certain stages we played well. And unfortunately, you know, with the games, uh, Ulster, um, you know, we, we couldn't squeeze a win through, you know, way. And, and I thought, you know, we played well against Toulouse as well. Obviously, it's a different competition, but, you know, we, we played some good rugby. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't get a result, but uh, luckily, you know, to, to today it went in our way. And, um, you know, what we focused on, you know, the boys did well and executed well on the day. If, if you've been coaching a long time as well, you know what it's like when a team starts to build up a bit of momentum. Do you, do you get that sense of the same side playing together now for a number of weeks is starting to hold that momentum going into the last couple of months. I think so. I think obviously if, 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 your, if your selection stays there and, and in the synergy as a team, you know, they, they, they start to, to, to understand, you know, the, the way that we want to play and the way that we want to build pressure in the game. Um, you know, luckily, luckily today, um, you know, Guzzi started on 10. I thought he played really well uh, up front. The force really laid a good foundation for him. Um, I thought Ambrose played well, so you know it's 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 it's, it's really it was a collective effort today, and you can't f find any fault. I think the guys that came on from the bench, you know, they did really well. So yeah, it was it was really a good performance, and and I think um, you know the areas that we wanted to fix, um, you know, the, the boys are getting that right. So hopefully uh, next week will be a different beast at home uh, at Loftus against Leinster. So, but you know, just proud of the boys uh, for tonight. Yeah. Last yeah, well, you obviously, you can see why they are Springbox and, and why they're currently in the, in the plans for the World Cup. So, um, yeah, I, again, I think, you know, if all the other players, you know, they do their work and, and, they, and they do well, you know, then obviously that gives some opportunities for Kurt and Kanan to, to, to shine. So, again, well done to the, to the team as, as a collective. Box in particular, how important does it become for a player like Johan Corson, who's also been talked about in, 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 in pop terms, to just make sure that he finishes the season on a high, especially the fact that now, um, with this one, your playoff hopes are still pretty much in your own hands? Yeah, I, again, um, I think, you know, Johan was injured out for a few weeks, and, um, you know, luckily for him, you know, he came back and then played him uh, 18 minutes. Um, you know, started well on fly and then finished on, on fullback. So, uh, again, I don't think for, for, for us, it's, 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 uh, uh, we want to do well as a franchise, you know, and for us, uh, going into next week, we've got to make sure that we are spot on uh, going into next week game. Um, Jake's often speaking about, I suppose, spoken about finishing very well. I mean, last season have been a simple example. There was a mid-season slam, but there was a very strong finish that led to the miracle of doubling up. Um, do you feel that there's also something something similar in, in the works, with, especially the fact that an away playoff is a reality of the sports? Yeah, um, well, again, we don't know where we're going to finish. Uh, so for us, it's, it's important that next week, you know, we nail that one first, and then wherever we we will get in the in the quarterfinal, hopefully, um, you know, then we'll look at that. But for us, it's so important that we get our stuff right for for next week on Loftus.